Lacey Spring hasn't had much of a break from flooding. Tonight, water levels are rising again near several roads that were shut down due to last week's flooding. Way 31's Megan Reyna joins us live from the barricaded Lower Dry Creek Road. Megan, how are people living in that area holding up? Well, it's not quite as bad as last time, but yes, there are some roads like this one behind me that are still blocked off. People around here are remaining cautious and trying to stay off the road as much as they can. This includes Sherry Allison. Allison lives not nearby. She says anytime there's a big rain event, she is constantly monitoring just how high the water gets around her home. You just have to stay up. You get naps. And you just have to worry if it's going to come real fast or real slow. But they've done a good job controlling it this year. Allison says it's been stressful and she's just ready for the sun to come back out. If you notice any roads around you starting to flood, you can contact the Morgan County Sheriff's Office. They'll come check it out and see if there needs to be a barricade like this one put up. For now, reporting live in Lacey Spring, Megan Reyna, Way 31 News.